Hell yeah, brother. You're on the Please Me For On YouTube channel. All right, all right, all right. Let's give this another shot, shall we? That again. Let's try that again. I blew it at the very end last time. We were ran so close. Time last time. You were this close and ran out of time. So, I don't know if we really make any changes. We just go out and give her a rip. Give it the same, same tire pressure, same everything as that 147 or 148 60 foot. Yeah, that was clean. All right. I like it, guys. The Rat Rod Supra is going to go eights today. As long as nothing breaks. Let's see what we can make happen. Starting at 15 pounds of tire pressure. All the boost. Right lane and a good Supra burnout and we're dialed. A Supra burnout involves hitting the rev limiter a minimum of six times. Is today the day that we run an eight? Man, I sure hope so. You know it's in there, just dying to come out. <laughs> Watching this thing do a burnout is just something. You can only imagine the fireballs coming out the back. Let's go, baby! one yet ah, <laughs> look at the tire dude dang she was ripping <laughs> Forty-two, two sixty. Right when I got in second, it was like breaking up. So I guess maybe it wasn't a protection. Maybe we burnt up a plug wire or something. What a one forty-two sixty? Yeah, dude, she was ripping. She was screaming. Yeah. So I was looking at this data log. This is RPM right here. All of a sudden, you see it. Burr, 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 burr. This red trace is fuel pressure, but I mean, it goes from like ninety-seven down to like ninety-five. It's barely a difference but the fuel pressure does start going down this is air fuel right here it does start getting weird but this, this crazy break of i'm not sure maybe it's fuel pressure dropping i have a half tank of fuel in the car I've, I've definitely made full pulls on it with less so i'm not sure why it's doing it you know what the gas gauge might be broken right now it ain't moving it didn't move when we put fuel in it lower than we think <laughs> we just put five gallons in it still shows the same hopefully she has a nice clean pull on this one we got a little gas in it not sure if that'll fix it but we're really hoping <laughs> man she sounds so smooth and clean in the burnout Fifty-five, man. Come on, baby.
not an eight, but that was pretty good. Not an eight, but that felt better than the other day. Probably a 936, if I had to guess. 928. Somewhere in that category. Man, this thing's swinging, dude. Honestly, I didn't think he was going to stay in it, and then I seen the 44, too. Uh, 149. Oh, 49. 149, yeah. 611 at 122. 929 at 155. Man. He probably thinks it was a 144, too. Yeah. Yeah, you I did. Piece, <laughs> I mean, that's 941. 929 at 145. Whoa. And that was, although the board said 144, it was 149 to 60 foot. The top of the nine was off. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. It's got bolts on the bottom. Yeah, yeah. It just clips in up there and then it's got bolts on the bottom. But you can see it's just been pretty empty. Yeah. It's oh. a rat rod, dude. All right, so 920s. 929. Now we're a ways off, dude. We're a ways to go. 155 mile an hour. We really got to get that 60 foot down. Needs to be at 135 or so. Needs to be at 140. <laughs> that uh, at least we got to run. Were you gonna get out of it and they got back in it kind of deal? There's like a little like pause. I really. Yeah. I was trying to make sure I got the shift. Oh, everything was good on that. All right, so everything looked real good besides this big spin right here, right? That's where it spun bad. I had to lift off the throttle and get back into it. That's where we need to make up some time and we'll get in the eights. All right, plan is to pull a little bit of power out, leave the tire pressures, everything else the same, just pull a smidge of power out through that 60 foot range, try and get it hooked up a little better. And then second year on, she's full boost, trying to make 45 pounds the whole way. 142, is that too much to ask? Come on, baby girl, let's get it. Big Supra slipping the clutch, flooring it, trying to go eighth kind of guy right here, dude. We need that 142. Come on, Supra. Let's do a little bit of slipping, a little bit of gripping, and a whole lot of action. Clutch slipping cleat, back again in the Supra. Let's see if we can't get this eight second rip out of the old rat rod today. We're struggling, but hey, you know, that's the name of the game. Just did again and just tighten up the shifts and they'll be an 899. Yep. 
And I'll turn up the boost a little bit. <laughs> yeah. I want to go 160 too. Third gear on, dude. All right, quick little update. We just went to 9 0. We're cooling her back down a little bit. You know, she's not too hot, but you know, we got to. We gotta keep keep, keep running cool, keep with, the cool AC. with AC. On the <laughs> <laughs> but the we do have a little James. Come show us what we got going on back here. You pointed something out to me, and uh, you know. Yeah, check this out. Let's talk about it real quick. We're not I gonna made, tell the driver about it. I made this mark on the rim that lined up with this mark on the tire. Yeah. In a straight line. <laughs> the last time we were here, it moved like one inch. And now, now we're all the way down here, <laughs> about four inches away. She's spinning. Yeah, but you know, super stuff, you know, they do that. Oh, that's normal? I guess. <laughs> Sounds good, don't it? It is what it is. Yeah, that's very true. All right. Because it's not getting changed before we run that eight. And we need to like Cletus himself screw him in there. No, she's good, dude. That's a little extra, a little extra slip for us. We need that. To go get some no, we need just the right amount of slip with the just enough right amount of grip <laughs> and right. a whole lot of action, and we'll get that eight ninety nine. All I'm saying. That's right. <laughs> tight up there now and then I gotta slip it and then it just blows. Oh. I thought that was gonna be it and then I see 142. Like it felt great. Yeah. Where'd it go? 90. 919 at 157. 142, 60 foot just yeah. slow it on One, down. 143. So it's just so unreal, dude. Sensor. If it needs that first 40 feet to be perfect. Uh oh. First hat toss of 24. Junk, dude. <laughs> Double down. Junk, dude. <laughs> All right. Here's the deal. Victor's been talking a lot of crap. The guy who built the car for me, you know. Victor. He says he can easily do it. We're going to get him down here. We're going to let him try. So at this point, I got to swallow my pride. I tried enough times. All 6,000 times I tried. I'm gonna call Victor, let him come down, show me how easy it is. How easy it is. Because apparently we're not two Jay-Z guys. Victor is a two Jay-Z guy. Let's see if he's got it. So we'll be back at the track with the Supra. 906 is all we're getting today. That's it for now. Thanks for watching. Do it for now. We'll break in. See you later. All right, bro. Since you've been talking all this smash, <laughs> we're gonna give you the car for two runs. You can bring your tuner, you your suspension runs, guys. Too? Now nah, you only get two because you said it's easy. Quote. It is easy. It is easy. All right, two runs. Bring your entire team. The car is yours. You can tune it, whatever you want. Two runs. Oh, and you can't use nitrous in the clutch slipper like you needed when you ran eights previously. No, 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 no. Take all the shit off. I don't want it. <laughs> it, no, it's off. They it don't have it. Okay. Good. I don't want any excuses. All right. I went 906. That's the best. You know, if you didn't sell the run every year. I know, I know. <laughs> I, I wish I would have. So, all right, next week, we're ready to see you do it. Okay, let me know what day. We will. <laughs>